Thank you so much for tuning in, Mr. Mitsubishi here. In today's video, we'll check out this. We're in a 2024 Mitsubishi Outlander GTP. It's a gas Outlander, fully loaded premium, as loaded as it gets. And I um, just want to show you this uh, driver uh, screen. So this is 12.4 inch driver screen, and there's some good information there and just sort of few basic things that you might need. Uh, please spend more time uh, with your vehicle and check out what all you have. If you have questions about, hey, is this function there or not? This is where you find most of your answers. I just want to very, very quickly show you uh, what's here and what kind of information can we find uh, on it. So to browse this menu, you want to use these buttons right here, left, right, and this one scrolls up and down and you confirm with this button, right? So this one back and out. And also one quick thing is I just want to show you there's two ways how you can lay out this whole screen. One is with these uh, gouges on the side, so RPMs on the side like this, and then you have speed there. And then you have this button right here, these uh, three lines with dots, that opens up the shortcut menu. So, and when you go change meter view, you can okay with this button and see you go back to these classic dials when you have a classic RPMs, classic speed. Uh, for sake of example, I'll just go back to the other one, change meter view, uh, so the more enhanced, so it pushes aside, gives you a little bit bigger information screen on what we can see. So. Um, when you go through these uh, settings, you have right here home screen uh, that's sort of like fairly, uh, you know, uh, blank with just the car direction and then the music that you're listening. Then you have the info with your uh, fuel economy and you can reset it by pressing and holding OK. So that will be this button right here. You just press hold and that will uh, reset all info okay now reset yes so now our fuel economy got reset we go back and there you go so then we have this uh, super oil control tab so you can see how your super oil control is working when you drive and uh, this one here again is just the compass direction so you see direction gives you the current uh, weather which you know it's cloudy and raining and i think system is right <laughs> it is cloudy and it's raining right now so we know that the system is uh working now next uh, we have the music selection and uh, this is where we have lots of information about the uh, MyPilot system and uh, this one here is where we have the settings and through the settings we can see there's like the traction control, the driver's assistance, all your blind spot information and everything else. So personal display so we can do like whatever we want to do, see this part right here, how it changes. So we have, we can change as a trip, gear position, navigation, leave it blank, whatever we want to do, we want to do it. Head up display. So here we can adjust the brightness, rotation, height, and contents to show. So this is a big one. So on the head up display, we can see that it can show you navigation, driving assist, traffic sign, audio, and your messages. So a lot of things it shows up on the, uh, on the navigation, uh, sorry, on the head up display. And we can see it right here, it's already, it's right there right so we have speed and all the information right there and gives you very big area of uh, information and just covers um, all that part now um, here you have the rest what's kind of like you know the vehicle settings as well so like electrical tailgate I know people sometimes ask about a work activated deactivate the electrical tailgate so that's happening here locks wipers so we can see you can uh, you know, have the speed sensing wipers, rain sensors on and off, and then all that stuff. So driving position, so exit seat. Aisle. So this is sometimes that some customers might also want, like if you want to turn off like the, the where your seat is sliding backwards, this is where you uh, want to do it. So I might actually made a separate video about this, uh, uh, you know, sliding seat exit uh, on and off. So uh, some people, Quite a few people ask that so maintenance and everything else let's click on maintenance there we go all control system there you go it shows when the oil changes do quite smart uh customize your display and here again like you can see a lot of information that you can uh, play around with now I always recommend spend some time on here. Just want to show you these basics, how to sort of like operate it, right? So you have, uh, you know, like these uh, buttons, what this is, and then this part here is just on and off, like for your, um, you know, my pilot system and whatnot. So take your time. Uh, feel free to uh, leave a comment if you wanna uh, just sort of just ask me about uh, something. 
and uh, I always try to uh, reply to all the comments and always try to uh, you know make a videos based on what everyone's commenting so I always leave it to either the, the, the blank screen or I always like to also track my fuel economy so this one here I quite often um, I like to see and then you have uh, all your information that you might need for your trip so there we go very quickly I want to show you what all information you can see that there's two ways how to display it and uh, that's that so thank you so much for checking out this video and uh, leave a comment see you next time